This is Karen Turner at Imagine Training. I'm going to talk today about having your files and documents stored in the cloud. Microsoft OneDrive, formerly known as SkyDrive, is a simple way to save and keep your documents free of charge. This means that you can access them when you're away from your PC if you have an internet connection. Microsoft OneDrive is now available on many different devices, so you can have it on your tablet and smartphone too. You're given up to 7 gig space free and you only need an email address to set up an account. Sign up and then when prompted sign in. I'm going to show you around my drive so that you can see how easy it is if you go to https colon forward slash forward slash onedrive dot live dot com you can create your own. When you first create your OneDrive it will be an empty storage space. Look at mine where I have created folders to store files, videos and photos. Here I have a folder where I'm keeping photos I had done for my social media. If I keep a copy here in the cloud I can share the photos with my colleague so she can access them and also I can get to them anywhere I have internet access. Let me show you how to create a folder. I go to create on the top menu bar where I choose folder. Now I'll click on upload and choose some family photos to store in that new folder. I can select multiple photos and drag them into the empty folder. It only takes a few moments and they've arrived in the cloud. Now that's my backup. Here I can show you that I keep my one notebooks in the cloud on OneDrive. This is a synchronized copy of those that I have on other devices. Here is an electronic note that I made of a meeting that I shared with colleagues and if I make changes here we will see the updates on any device we open OneNote on as it keeps the changes. Clicking on create gives me access to my web apps. Here I can create an Excel spreadsheet and make some formulas to work out tax on these invoices. If I continued adding invoices to create a list I could perhaps then format the list as a table giving me the ability to filter the list of invoices perhaps by which one is paid. If I want to I can open this spreadsheet in Excel and then save my changes back to the OneDrive. Thanks for joining me and having a look at OneDrive. Hope you found it useful.